as Intel plans to launch its Tiger Lake processor on September 2nd, uh, it's time to look at what AMD has in plan later this year in the Gen 3. And I wanted to give you a quick update on Gen 3 today with respect to Gen 2. The first uh, important thing is that it's not a 5 nanometer processor. It's just an upgrade from 7 nanometer to 7 nanometer plus. That's what AMD calls it. It's an extreme ultraviolet lithography that makes the yields a little better uh, and easier. And that's what Intel is also moving on into EUV, extreme lithography, that we will see in like somewhere around 2021. In Gen 4, by that time, AMD will be moving to the 5 nanometer from TSMC. It could be 2021 late or it could come early 2022. And that would be, because it would be a significant jump to 5 nanometer, we will see uh, some uh, decent amount of performance upgrade over there. So, uh, between Gen 2 and Gen 2, in, in addition to whatever other process uh, improvement uh, in and the performance per uh, cycle, those kind of improvement, those could, you could see that the power uh, we, we have the power consumption will be down by 10% and that will improve our the laptop uh, battery life and so on. But we could also see a density going up to 20%, going up by 20%. You can fit in more, um, more transistors in that given area. So this is, we already are seeing a, some details of Ryzen 9 4950X. That will have uh, 16 cores and 32 hyper threads. Uh, that will be a great, good smasher to whatever existing desktop is exist and in terms of benchmark. And that should have Intel worried uh, because Intel does not have anything close or planned close to the 16 core monster that we that AMD planned. The, the good thing with Gen 3 is that we'll still use the uh, same motherboard of uh, the same series that Gen 2 used and it will not be using DDR5 and that will come with the Gen 4 uh, sometime 2021 or later. So this is what about it. Uh, it's, it's coming up a year or so later after the Gen 2 architecture which is very successful but uh, Gen 3 makes it a little better. Thanks for taking a look.